Hey guys, welcome to another Reaper blog tutorial. In this video, I want to tell you about Repack. Repack is a download manager for Reaper that really speeds up the process of downloading and updating scripts. Up until now, the process to find a script, download it, install it, has been a bit of a pain. And anytime there was an update, you'd have to go through the process again. As well, you'd have to do that for every single script. Now with Repack, you get a download manager that comes with 500 new scripts, plus it automatically updates. So it keeps track of when new scripts are added to the package. You can install and uninstall, and it will even keep track of which things are obsolete. So this is what it looks like. I'll show you where to get it from this page here. I'll have a link in the show notes. Uh, there's a very good step-by-step -step tutorial here. I'm gonna show you this stuff quickly, but just understand that this is going to speed up the process of finding your scripts and downloading them and installing them into Reaper, plus updating them automatically. And if you're a script maker, this is going to be a great thing for you because you can distribute your scripts or JS plugins or other repack friendly bits of code. Instead of uploading to the Reaper stash separately for each file, you can create a package and it'll download automatically into Reaper when the user wants it. Uh, this is a really great thing. I cannot stress that enough. It's a great new feature for Reaper built by some great people outside of the Reaper team. So I'm gonna grab the latest download at the time of this video, it's this one. I'm on 64-bit Mac, so I'm going to take this file and save it. I'm gonna open up my portable Reaper install. I'm going into the user plugins folder, and I'm dropping this in. So I will just open up my portable Reaper install and we can see what this is like for the first time. So once it's in there, we have this extensions menu and we have repack up at the top. We have synchronized packages, browse packages, import a repository, manage repositories, and some information about it. Let's look at the about page first. Here we have some information about it. We can see which packages are installed. Currently nothing is installed other than the uh, repack extension itself. I close this and go up to repack again and go to manage. So we need to choose which packages we're going to install. I'm going to select these, right click and enable them, and then click on browse packages from here. So it downloaded the file list from those repositories, the collections of scripts made by the various users. And we see here the total amount of packages is 509. So that's different scripts um, that can be JS plugins, it could be track templates, it could be project files, anything that can be added to GitHub and formatted a certain way for Repack can be shared here, through here. So right now there's nothing installed. You can look here at what is installed and it's just the extension. Select all, right click, install or update. So that puts it on this little capital I, meaning that it's going to install we click apply and it's going to install these 508 actions. It's just going to take a few moments. Once you install repack and get all those files downloaded, you have over 500 new scripts added to Reaper. They add a ton of powerful features. One example is split selected items at stretch markers. There are a ton of automation actions, options for creating regions, creating text items, nudging item volume, quantizing items, randomizing items, a massive list of additional functions for Reaper. So if you are a Reaper user, I highly recommend getting this. It's free. It's very, very powerful. If you are a scripter, please get your stuff repack ready and get it where people can find it. Putting up your scripts on Stash or in a random thread in the forum, they're not going to be seen. Uh, put them in repack and people can actually get access to them very easily and quickly. All right, guys, that's it for this video. There will be links in the description and in the blog post for Repack. Get it installed. You'll really enjoy the extra actions. Thanks a lot for watching. Please subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and visit reaperblog.net for a lot more.